So really quickly, I wanted to show you guys, um, cause I never come on IG, so I'm just putting this little video together. Uh, my really quick uh, eye look out of the festival. What is this festival? The festival of Halle by Julia. So all I did was take this yellow shade first. I have down the Fenty primer, the amplifying primer from Fenty. I really like it, um, and it works really well with these Juvia Place um, eyeshadows to me. It keeps me from having to do a lot of work. Um, the pigmentation is already there for Juvia's Place. I'm just going to show you guys really quick this little quick little look that I'm throwing together. I'm using the Festival Palette by Juvia's Place, and I'm just taking that mustardy yellow shade and just stamping it on. And then I took a little bit of the peachy type shade and just kind of blended it out on top. Two little quick eyeshadow look. Just spend a little time blending it up into the crease. Just kind of feathering it through. Nothing complicated. So really that is really the eye look for today. Um, kind of wanted the mustardy shade, of course, to be the star of the show. Just packing it back on for what I thought I lost. Okay, I have this mustardy gold that I'm adding from the Warrior, the first palette, the Warrior palette. And I'm just taking my finger, picked up a little bit, and I'm just kind of censoring it. Make sure you go back and add your mustard back in to kind of clean up those edges a little bit. It's okay to go over that shade just a little bit. Go back in and fluff it. Okay, y'all, for a pop of color, I did add a little bit of blue. This is um, Marc Jacobs Blue Eyeliner. I don't know the color because I can't see it, but it's blue. <laughs> <laughs> to intensify the blue um, a whole lot, I did take Juvia's Place Africu Blue. Okay, I can't pronounce it, y'all. I'm sorry, but it's this blue right here. I used it underneath to kind of intensify the blue. So I am going to do an inner corner highlight. I am just using the middle shade from the Warrior palette and I'm just kind of taking it right here, just dabbing it on, getting it built up. To get your inner corner. I'm really excited about this look, y'all. For the lips, we just went in with Kat Von D's, uh, what color is, anyway, and the brown pencil liner and then I went in with Fenty Gloss um, Lip Balm. That ain't the name. Okay, so this is so Pilophilia, I think is the name from Kat Von D. This is Molasses by Sephora. This is their lip liner in the gel. And then this is the Fenty Lip Gloss um, Gloss Balm. So finishing touches is I always take this brow mascara from Wet n Wild and just kind of comb through my brows to set them. And they'll last all day. For the eyelashes, I say that the liquid part for last, I just kind of use this NYX liquid liner to kind of go over um, the gel liner that I placed down, just to clean it up a little bit. So to intensify the blue down here, I'm actually going to go in with the NYX, this color mascara that I have. It is blue. And this is pretty much the final look. We're going to go to work like this today. Um, I think this is really simple and cute. It was only really three eyeshadows and then some pop of color beneath. And I think that this just kind of elevates the look sometimes when you want to skip. I also me. want to show you that you, this is all basically a lot of um, affordable makeup on my face today. This is the NYX uh, Can't Stop, Won't Stop Foundation. Um, the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. Um, and never forget to set your makeup. Um, I use the Rose Water from um, what's the people? Mario Badescu. I use that to take out the powders, and I use to take out the powdery look, and then I use the uh, I use the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist to kind of set everything in place and just let it dry, and then you are ready. This will give you longevity in your makeup look. Um, let me know if you guys like this type of video from me today. You know, just kind of giving you little pointers here and so there. So not really a full tutorial, but just kind of like little pointers, especially since I did such a simple eye today. Let me know if you'd be interested in seeing more of those types of things. I'm going to put a poll up after this so you guys kind of let me know on one of the pictures how you feel.